Hello everyone. So today we will discuss about TCP flags. So in TCP connections, flags are used to indicate a particular state of connection or to provide some additional useful information like troubleshooting purpose or to handle the control of particular connection. These are the nine type of flags and TCP you can say six are common use and three are special case. Okay, so we will discuss about all one by one. We will discuss like how many flags are there. So in in screen you can see uh, if I talk about nine flag, so one is sync flag okay second is tag okay third is rst fin flag fifth is push URG okay so as I told these are the six flags which we use commonly and our other flags are seven eight nine okay so we will discuss this CWR eight is ECE and ninth is NS okay so this is used for the connection perspective and now we will discuss about each flag one by one so if we talk about these two flag so first two flag these are used for initiate connection Okay, so RST and FIN used for about connection. So push and URZ, these are used to for the data transfer. Okay, so now if we talk about this flag. So first of all, like we will discuss about SYN. What is SYN like? SYN is a synchronization and it used in first step of con uh, connection establishment or three-way handshake process between two hosts. Let's take example, like uh, this is my uh, host one and this is host B. Okay, so they are they want to communicate to each other okay so they will initiate a sync communication and it will send the sync and then it will reply that okay it will also send the uh, the request like uh, and only the first packet from sender as well as receiver should have this flag set this is used for synchronization synchronize sequence number example to tell the other end which sequence number they should accept so next we will talk about ACE <clears throat> ACE it is used to acknowledge packet which are successful received by the host it will send the SYN packet and it will give the acknowledgement means it is used to acknowledge packet which are successful received by the host okay so this is my host a and this is my host b the flag set of acknowledgement number field contain a valid acknowledgement number 
so next we will talk about rst rst stand for reset basically it is common it is used to terminate the connection if the rst send rst sender feels something is wrong with the tcp connection or that the conversation should not exit like you can say the conversation is not exist it can get sent from receiver side when packet is sent to particular host that was not expecting it this is my host a and this is my host b okay host is sending the request in cnac and now my destination which is host b my destination is sending the rst packet yeah it can be uh, any code like uh, this remote system is not able to handle the request okay so it can be any reason like uh, it can be the reason the remote and server is sending the rst packet to the requester so next we have the fin fin is a finish it is used to request to connection termination when there is no more data from the sender so this is my host a and this is my host b okay so how this fin will work host a and b they will send the syn communication and then you see acknowledgement happen they will transfer the data next they will initiate the fin and if there is no any data you send the fin acknowledgement fin is also similar to rst but it gracefully terminate the connection so next we will discuss about pusa push and urb connection it's a transport uh, layer by default wait for some time for application layer to send enough data equal to maximum segment size so that the number of packet transmit on network minimize which is not desirable by some applications like interactive applications okay so means in the push uh, let's take example uh, this is my host a and this is my host b okay so host a want to send the data to host b so you know the osi layer application layer presentation layer session layer transport layer network layer data link layer and physical layer same another end also session layer transport layer network layer data link layer and presentation layer so when host want to send the data it will come on the application layer presentation layer session layer transport layer in the transport layer tcp header will attach same thing okay so it will attach and So in journal, it tells the receiver to process this packet as they are received instead of buffering them. Like similarly, transport layer at receiver end buffers packet and transmit application layer if it meets crit uh, certain criteria. So this problem is solved by PUSH push and transport set pus1 and immediately send the segment to the network layer as soon as it receives signal from the application layer so next we have urg 
let's say you can say urgent like and uh, for this push ftp is a example of that and in a push telnet is example so like data inside a segment with urg okay one flag is forwarded to application layer immediately even if there are more data to be given to the application layer it is used to notify the receiver to process the urg packet before processing all other packet okay so let's take example this is my pc1 and pc2 okay so telnet is the best best example of this it will check like uh, telnet my google.com and port a443 okay so immediately it will send the request and you can check like uh, uh, my connection is working or not and next we have three additional tcp flag these cwr ECE and STP flags are not commonly used, but we will discuss about this. Basically, CWR congestion window has been reduced. Okay, it indicates that the sending host has received a TCP segment with the ECE flag set. So, what is ECE? ECE is a explicit congestion echo. The conjunction window is in the internal variable maintained by TCP to manage the size of the send window. So next we have ECE. So what is ECE? As I told, like ECE is a explicit conjunction echo. It indicates that host is ECE, ECN enable or not. ECN is explicit conjunction notification. So like that is capable during the three-way handshake on the connection like and it is like uh, you can say like uh, ECN nodes and explicit congestion notification and concealment protections used for. 